Sue Tyler from Power 104, getting set for the Great Okanagan Beer Festival coming to Kelowna May 12th through to the 14th. Now, I wanted to get to know craft brewers just a little bit better. It's just really how I roll. So I'm in North Vancouver talking to Brett Jamison, brewmaster at Deep Co. Brewmasters are really the hottest people on the planet right now. I, I mean, I, I don't blame them. We're, a, we're of a, a, a special breed. I definitely agree with that. But uh, no, but seriously, it's a, it, it's really funny because we're, we're just trying to make good beer and hopefully what we like, people like, uh, that's kind of the creed of every brewer out there, so yeah. And you, like every other brewmaster, takes great pride in the products that they produce. What am I drinking here right now? So you are on our rye IPA right now, which uh, uses a heavy dose of rye malt, which adds like a really nice kind of spicy, earthy flavor. Uh, and on top of it, we added a ton of Australian Galaxy hops, which is uh, a really nice Southern Hemisphere hop that has a lot of tropical flavors that offsets that spice. Yeah, it's sneaky as well. It's seven percent, but drinks kind of like it's four or five. So, so coming into spring. Are you going to change around what you're brewing and have more seasonal brews? Yes, we have a, a few seasonals. Uh, right now, actually, as you're here, we're brewing with uh, Persephone Brewing to do a, it's called a Coffee Common. So we're doing a, a collaboration where we're brewing a California Common. We're going a little heavier on the alcohol, but adding uh, a lot of uh, coffee in the end. So it's a, a really nice kind of sipper for the spring as it comes, uh, as the, it warms up into summer. So, so yeah. Deep Cove, we're really looking forward to coming to the Okanagan is the Great Okanagan Beer Festival in May. What yep. will we be sampling when you come to the Okanagan? Well, it's one of my favorite festivals personally. It's a gorgeous location and last year it was unbelievable. It was it was so hot and amazing and being able to sit by the lake with the, some samples of incredible BC craft beer. Uh, and we're going to be bringing, uh, we'll bring some of the Coffee Common for sure. Oh, will you? Yeah, Great. Okay, have, good. Yeah, absolutely. We'll save some and bring it up. Uh, it's going to be awesome. Uh, Anders and the boys over at Persephone are great members, so I have no doubt it'll turn out really well. Fantastic. Uh, Anders is in the background there. He is, yeah. Away. Wanna, yeah. <laughs> so is that how it works that breweries get together and do these, like, you know, menage brewing? Yeah, so brewers That'd be really great love name for a brewery. Yeah. yeah, it would for sure. <laughs> yeah, the uh, there's a couple so. breweries down on uh, on on Powell Street, Powell Street Brewing and Doans. I really want them to do a collaboration and call it the New Kids on the Block. But ah. yeah, uh, the um, yeah, it's really great being a brewer because all brewers are they love helping each other out and talking about beer doing collaborations and things like that. I feel like it's the sales guys that really have to fight with each other. So when it comes to brewers, it's all brotherly love. He is such a great guy. Brett Jamison from Deep Co. Thank you so much for having us. What a great time. And I did want to mention that Deep Co. does not just brew beer. They also distill vodka and gin. Now, we didn't get a chance to do any sampling when we were there because, well, I've already had quite a few beers, so, you know, there's pacing involved. But when you go to Deep Cove, make sure you check out the beautiful distillery that they have. It's right in the front doors. It is absolutely gorgeous. Look at this thing. And when you come to the Great Okanagan Beer Festival, May 12th through to the 14th, make sure you sample some Deep Cove.